Now that the update's complete, we've just we've disconnected the iPad from the computer, and it should show you this setup screen here. You just scroll here, and then you can start setting up. You want English? Pretty easy choice. Uh, you're in the United States. Again. Uh, this is location services. Location services allows Map and other apps to gather and use data indicating your approximate location. We disable this, but you can do whatever you want. Uh, just, just making sure, and you can press OK. This is just basically going to identify all the available Wi-Fi networks. You guys know ours, BPS in Burlington. Okay. Should be readily accessible to you guys. Then. And everybody knows the password to the Wi-Fi as well, so just enter that, and you'll be all set. That should work. That just takes a little bit of time to connect to the Wi-Fi. And it's connected, and then you just press next. Now it just has to activate your iPad, and like it says, oh, it took, didn't take that much time. And this is how you restore your iPad from a backup. You can choose set up as a new iPad, restore from iCloud backup, or restore from iTunes backup. We're going to set this up as a new iPad. A lot of you guys will have the iTunes backup already before your update, so you'll want to connect it back to your computer, and it'll just set up by itself. Just let the uh, update run, but for our purposes, we're setting it up new. And we can make, you can put in your Apple ID, you just say sign in with an Apple ID. Uh, we don't have one of those right now, so we'll just do skip this step. Are you sure? Skip. You can always go back and do that. This is the terms and conditions. And again, just kind of do what everybody else does and hit agree. Just don't do anything stupid on the iPads. I agree that the iOS terms and conditions agree. Uh, this is when your iPad crashes. You can send diagnostics. Diagnostics are why it crashed. And um, so Apple can figure out solutions to the bugs. So we're going to do automatically send. And then you can start using your iPad. And there you go.